how to rename your videos on your Android. These devices can take some really good video. Now, I'm gonna show you how you can rename your videos, both if you're gonna upload them and use them yourself, but or if you're gonna hand them off to an editor or something like that. Just by doing that, you'll make it easier than rather video one or video two. So grab your phone and we'll cover that now. I am Michael Hill, joining the Diana Running Design and Marketing Agency. On the evening, I do videos like this. If you want more videos to help grow your business using all aspects of the internet, web, video, and marketing, do follow us by tapping the subscribe button now. It's free, it's YouTube's answers to favorites. Also turn on the bell notification so you don't miss out on any important videos. So rename your photos, grab your phone. We're gonna to go to the gallery icon initially there's going to be a couple of ways of doing this i'll cover two fairly quickly and also how to create a folder to move these videos into uh, in videos coming shortly i'll show you how you can actually send large uh, video files to somebody without you actually blocking their email box as well uh, which is pretty particularly useful if you want to send them off to an editor or stuff like that so with your phone in hand let's go to the gallery icon Now, unlike what I've just done, we're not looking to play it. If you tap, so on the right, if you do a long hold on the, t if you tap it on the right hand corner, you see those three dots. If you tap that, simply the rename or pop up in the pop up box. If you tap rename, again, rename the video so it makes sense, particularly for yourself. And if you're going to upload this, if this has already been edited and it's been uploaded, it's going to be uploaded to the web, YouTube, or something like that having the title there is there is um people saying if you've got the words or what the video is about it'll help it rank better not necessary uh on youtube but if you're putting it on your own website and stuff like that having the actual name actually gives google a clue what the video is about so we're going to go to the file if you find files the file manager the icons uh, vary from which version of Android you've got. So I'll put some icons of what it could look like on your version. But what we're looking to do, if we go to the video tab, because that's where these are going to be, I'm going to tap camera. There, as you can see, there's that one we've just renamed using the gallery method. Now, if we do a long hold, a long tap, on the one we want. We're not looking to open it. Again, depending what software you've got or what apps you've got on your device, it will look to open it in one of those particular apps. So we're not actually looking to open it. So again, if we just tap it, you'll see at the top, the three dots. You, you can use that. Another method, if you go back to the browser or the file manager, do a long hold, you'll see a little tick box so if you press that and at the bottom of the screen, you'll see the more icon. If you tap the three dots there, you've got more. And again, the rename will pop up there. So that's the other method of renaming. Again, both do the same things. It's, just, it's the same way of doing it, but different ways of getting to it. So the last thing we want to do is let's imagine we're going to be using these videos in the future instead of them just being on random spots on your, your phone, let's organize them. So we'll go to, back to the file, tap internal storage. Now if we tap the bottom, you'll see more. Let's tap more. We're gonna create a new folder. A name that would actually make sense. So if these are your videos for your car shoot or whatever, let's give it that. So I'm going to say videos for 2025. Now, back to the inter internal storage. Let's go back to camera where those files are. Now, if we, get in, if we do a long hold, let's select, select the two files in this case. Press the move icon in the middle. It's on internal storage. Let's go and find that folder we've not long created. Tap that and then just confirm the move by tapping the move icon at the bottom. And that's it. Those are those two images. They're not being duplicated, they've been moved. So we're not eating up more space on your device. If you have found this helpful, do give us a thumbs up or star rating, depending which option you've got. Also, if you know somebody who would benefit from this, a business owner or stuff like that, who's probably got loads of business videos on their phone, which they could do with renaming and using, by all means, share this video.